Hi, I'm Oscar van Deventer and this is the Weird Disc 4x12. As you can see from its name, we have two rotation axes, one with 4 volt symmetry and one with a 12 volt symmetry. And this puzzle can be considered a flat equivalent of the Brems sphere by Brem Cohen. So I was wondering whether the Brems sphere could be made flat, and yes it could. And it works uh, surprisingly well, so this is the second prototype. For the first prototype I used these uh, little bits, I hope you can see them. So the whole thing was very flimsy, I had them in place here and it didn't turn at all. Uh, and also these parts bend so the pieces start falling out. So I made a second prototype and let me show you how that works. So the way it works is that you can turn one of the sides, uh, well for instance the, the brown red uh, center and then we can turn the, in the other direction, let's see. Sometimes we have a little bit of uh, lockups but uh, the turning is excellent, uh, much better than I had dared to hope. So now we have the blue one here and let's uh, move the the brown one inside, here we are, and now we can move things along a bit more. So it's uh, quite surprising how well this works and it's a fun puzzle, it uh, looks nice. I'm pretty sure that it will take a lot of time to scramble it and even more time to uh, then solve it. So my question to you is about these uh, flat uh, weird disc type of puzzles uh, of this style. I said it was uh, based on the Brems sphere and this is 4 by 12 but there is another geometry that has also two numbers A and B that uh, can be flat. So my question to you is uh, what is A and what is B? Thank you for watching.